This right here is the Simplex 4903-9426 True Alert. With most Simplex True Alerts, you need a Simplex Fire Alarm Control Panel or a Simplex Module in order to use them. This is a special model True Alert where it can run on its own without any of those Simplex parts. With that being said, this particular model of Simplex True Alert is really great for fire alarm collectors because we can wire them up and use them without having to order a Simplex fire alarm control panel or module. Probably the most common True Alert out there is the Simplex 4906-9127. And this is one right here, and as you can see, they both look the exact same. And why would that be? Well, this one is a SmartSync True Alert, so you do need a simplex panel or a special simplex module in order to wire this up and use this. So just a big note, if you're a fire alarm collector, you're going to want to find a simplex free run true alert and not a smart sync true alert so you can actually use it in your collection. Okay, so just taking a closer look at the simplex true alert, as you can see it has a square body, it's got the horn at the top, the strobe in the middle, and then the fire lettering at the bottom. At the very top of the alarm it says true alert and on the right side it says simplex. Looking at the back it gives the model of the alarm and once again this is the free run version so its model is going to be 4903-9426. You can use a screwdriver on the sides to pop off the plastic cover and when you do that you get to see the inside. So the free run version that I have here is a four wire true alert. Most of the smart sync true alerts are just going to be two wire. So as you can see you have two wires powering the horn and two wires powering the strobe. And if you want to use two wire operation you just put in jumpers like I did here. As you can see on the inside here this is the horn of the alarm and there's nothing too special about it. As you can see Simplex made a couple different mounting options for the back box and it's most commonly used on a double gang or a single gang back box. Right next to the terminal you can see there is a little red switch there and that switch actually can change the true alert into a smart sync or a free run true alert. So with this model you have that option of changing it between the different styles which is very nice for collectors. Okay, now we're gonna go ahead and test the alarm so you can see what it sounds like. Chances are, if you see one of these in a building, it'll be programmed to code three by the fire alarm control panel. But today, since it's just wired with batteries, it's gonna be on continuous. All right, in three, two, one. That's pretty loud, isn't it? In the United States, these fire alarms are very common. Simplex, which is owned by Johnson Controls, is a very big company. So next time you're in a building, look for one of these. And if you find one, you're going to know everything about it. Have a great day, everyone.